yo, what does... Hey, listen, this is what I've said. Somebody called me from a very powerful media organization before. And um, it was a lot of stuff that was going on about you. And, and they re they liked your music, but they wanted to get a pulse of, like, who you were as a person. And given that I, I've, I've talked to you a, a couple of times, I was talking to him, and I was like, yeah, this is a smart kid. But... Young it, man. It, it, the... I think the sentiment, even between me and the person I was talking to, is that how does the story of Tentacion end? If it ends. How does it end? Like, 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 does it end like... How is it supposed to end? How is it supposed to end? Let me tell you how it's supposed to end. The neg the, the, the people in the positive aspect clearly see that I'm trying. The most important thing is that you try. You know what I'm saying? That you just do it. That I'm trying. That I'm trying to be a better person. They let this fucking case, this court case go where it needs to go, which is drop or... Or shit, throw me on probation or some shit. Let me be on probation. Put it, run it concurrent or some shit. You know what I'm saying? Let me be on probation. Monitor me and see who, what I turn into. And if I'm about my word, I'm going to turn into what I said I'm going to turn into. Which is someone that's going to positively mold the youth and move it toward, forward. And then after that, I get off probation. They give me the freedom to do what I need to do. I stay in my, I stay consistent in my ways. You know what I'm saying? I don't revert, I don't revert back to my old mind state. I don't re and I and I don't revert, and bro, I try and live as long as I can for these kids and die a good and die a good death. Um, because if I don't if I don't live long, they not gonna want to live long. For, for seeing, Kurt, seeing Kurt Cobain, seeing Kurt Cobain, blow his brains out, meant a lot to me. I idolized suicide. I thought it was cool. I thought it was a gangster way to go out. Cause it's just a full ass. I don't give a fuck. It's like, fuck, fuck my mama feelings, fuck my sister feelings, fuck my auntie feelings, fuck my grandma feelings. You know what I'm saying? And I idolize that because it's like, I'm living for y'all and I didn't ask to live. You understand? I looked at it like, damn. So it's like really caring about yourself to a degree. Like finally caring about yourself. Like, yo, fuck this. I don't want to live. Fuck this. You know what I'm saying? And I idolize that. But I realize you don't see the light at the end of the tunnel that way. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Ask me the question again. Ask me the question again. No, I was saying, how does this story end? And what, what how I does gonna, it end? What, what I, I gonna... live. I live as long as I possibly can, so these kids can see as possible, and then boom, I die either of old age or from a fucking or somebody murder me or some shit. Fuck it. You nigga, nigga you seen John Lennon was on his shit. John Lennon was about peace. Hey, what, what, they what, what, murdered that nigga. That, that's what I was going to say to you. It feels like anytime you get somebody who could either be a revolutionary or a renaissance. I don't want to be no fucking revolutionary, bro. No, no, but Listen. anytime you go about things And if I was going to be a revolutionary, way, I wouldn't even say it. No, you or, know what I'm saying? Or even someone who, who has the power not only just through music, but the power to move people um, a certain no, way. I don't want to be no revolutionary because I understand, bro. So, all right. Creation and evolution. But there's also the option of destruction. Destruction in order for what? Who the fuck is... All right, look at it this way. Sheep and shepherd. Who the fuck gonna lead the sheep? The shepherd, nigga. Who, who's gonna lead them if they have? A, if we have a big fucking revolution and we destroy the system that we have? Yeah, it's a fucked up system, but it's a system. So why the fuck I'm gonna try and contest that? It needs to be more even, yeah. They need to stop fucking over young niggas. Yeah, they need to stop playing with people's lives. Yeah, but that don't mean I'm going to destroy this shit. That don't mean I'm going to revolt. That don't mean I'm going to be no, a, a fucking retard. I'd be fucking retarded to do that. I would have been dead if I was going to do it. I would have told niggas go riot. I have that power, but I don't want to do that, bro. What I want to do is I want to I want to teach people not only to be self-aware, bro, because learning to be self-aware is a very important thing. Because when you learn to be self-aware and you learn to be in your mind, bro, you can escape this shit, bro. You don't got to 24-7 feel the need to be fucking codependent. That's the real hell. So Does I want to teach them to be self-aware. I want to teach them how to compromise and find true love, bro. I want to teach them how to respect themselves. How to let the persona take over themselves so they can feel important without being idolized by the, the amount of numbers that I have. You know what I'm saying? That they can appreciate what they do have. Because I'm still trying to teach myself appreciation. So, how the story ends? This case get this case 
This case, get, this case gets dropped or I get on probation. I get on probation, I work on my music, I drop the most fire fucking albums back to back to back to back till I get bored of this shit. Then I stop. They miss me for a little while, but I stop. I stop doing that shit because I want to stop doing it. Then I drop one more album. Then I say, fuck this because the music shit does get tiring, bro. This shit not fun forever, bro. Niggas enjoy this shit in the beginning. It's not fun forever, bro. This shit, it gets draining, bro. Because you have to drain your thought, bro. You have to put your thought and your soul on the paper. I understand you're going to ask a question, but hold on. Mm -hmm. After that, I dropped the, I, when I dropped that last one, then, bro, then, bro, I might fuck around become a monk on these niggas. I might fuck around, go to India or Asia, retire out there, and, and really, 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 really master my mind. And then if, if if they wanna follow in my footsteps and, and see what I did, then they do. But bro, let me tell you something. We're not supposed to sensationalize and idolize this jail shit, bro. That shit that shit not cool, bro. That shit is not cool, bro. That shit is hell, bro. That is hell. That is hell on earth. That is hell on earth. That is literally hell on earth. I have never I have never actually bro, like there was times where I wanted to die when I was young. But I was most content with death when I was there. If I had an opportunity, I, w I probably would have. You know what I'm saying? That shit is hell to me. So, if they, bro, if they let a nigga, bro, ex excuse me. If they let a young man be a young man and they let me move on with my life and let me be the person I need to, I, 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 I need to be, not only for myself, but for the kids. Because, bro, if they fuck me over, bro, they fucking up the kids, bro. And it's sad, but it's the truth. Bro, people feel like they got so much control over, the, over their kids, but no, fam. The internet really do. And I'm a, a fucking internet sensation. Behind uh, It was behind some negative shit, but I turned it into a positive. Now, if they let it be turned into a negative, they basically saying, fuck their kids. Literally. And I'm not... And that I fucking hate how manipulative that sounds, but it's the truth. 